Alright. Hey guys, what's up? It's a new beer. And today in this video, <laughs> I'm gonna be talking about my experience of being constantly doxxed by people online and also how someone got access to my bank account and spent $700 of my money. And finally, and this literally just happened about two days ago, how I almost got my YouTube, someone almost hacked my YouTube account. Like, um, basically, I was getting notifications of with, like, someone, um, trying to log onto my account, but thank god I have, like, the, um, 2FA, and he didn't, in the end, he didn't actually got into it. But for him to get to that step, he basically has to, wait, this guy cheating? Uh, okay, um, he basically has to have my, you know, full password and logging information, and then basically I got like a Google verification code, and it's just nah, all these things are just happening. So yeah, I'm gonna be going through them one by one in this video. <laughs> um, normally, when I make a uh, videos on when I make a video on YouTube, it's that um, when you guys watch it, you get entertained. It's just um, yeah, the way how it is. But then in this video, it's more of that you guys are also helping me by listening to my story um, because. What's happening right now is that uh, due to special reasons, two of my close friends that I normally, you know, actually talk with, um, for some special reason, they stopped, I mean, they moved away, and right now I can't really hang out with them like how I used to anymore. So, again, basically what this means is that I don't really have someone that I can really have some IRL interaction with, and... I've just always had all these stressful things as you guys know it's not easy being on this platform and you have to deal with like all kinds of people it is just pretty dumb but then yeah as the pressure builds up and I have no one to really talk to and again well people might be like oh why don't you tell your parents well if you are a new viewer so basically um, I don't really I'm not the type of person that communicates a lot with their parents I actually uh, barely really talk with them. I mean, I spend most of the time uh, in my room and the only time when I get to talk with my parents is when we're eating or something. So, because um, I still think that they're not really gonna like support me uh, starting a gaming channel and still, I mean, yeah, you guys know, Asian parents, I'm not gonna explain too much on this, I'm getting off topic here. So, what's been happening is that um, I've been constantly dogs by people. Like, more like them attempting to dox me. Uh, so far, there are already like, I don't know, three um, bedless noob dox files online or whatever. I guess people are probably gonna go search it up, but you guys, if you guys are too curious, um, it's fine. Okay, first I need to tell you, none of these dogs are actually successful. They think they actually got my info, but then... Except for my YouTube business email, which you can basically obtain on the about page in my YouTube channel. All the other info were just wrong but then in the end they probably even did also the wrong person one of them even said that they got my IP and then uh, he's saying that he's gonna like um, basically uh, DDoS me when I started streaming but then uh, he do he probably uh, DDoS the wrong person which is kind of sad for whoever he DDoSed uh, let me see oh, so now aqua guy is over there should I interfere with this uh, should I just uh okay let me just take yellow team out i don't know okay it's it almost happens every um every probably like at least once every two weeks there's just always like someone uh, that is threatening to like ddos me or something or someone already dos docks me and then they just say oh well look well is new your IRL name is this and stuff like that i mean um again none of them were really successful none of them got the actual info i mean uh i'm a very insecure person irl too and then uh, i do a lot of like precautions to in like prevent these things from happening but still it is just so annoying and it's really pissing me off and stressful just to have people that are constantly attempting to like dox you but again I even like I I've thought about it even if one day they actually manage to like get somehow somehow actually got my actual info I can just not admit it I'm gonna be like all right cool like he wouldn't like he wouldn't know if he actually if it was a success dox 
But then again, like, why do you do this? Like, um, so to be honest, there was once I got curious and I actually reached out to one of the doctors. I was asking, um, what is the purpose of this? Like, does this guy want money or like, why is he doctoring me? And then, um, so this one doctor specifically, he just said that, oh, I just hate big ego YouTubers. And then he's saying, oh, look, you have Subcon, look, you have big ego. But again, if you guys really watch my videos, I don't think I'm that type of person. I'm not like, oh, wow, look, I have subs. I am so much better than everyone else. If you watch my stream, I I've even mentioned this. Like, you guys, you guys need to, wait, wait. <gasps> oh, this guy's collecting M's. Oh my god, nice. That really scared me. Okay, let's try just getting him. Um, like, if you guys watch my stream, I've emphasized this. Alright, guys, you guys can... You guys don't really have to, like, fanboy or anything. Like, a lot of time I just say, alright, let's keep this stream uh, more commentary-focused and stuff like that. Uh, just because I have a channel and some following count doesn't mean I am someone special. It's just that I know how to edit, and then I have a, a, a really dumb personality that people find dumb and you guys watch for entertainment i guess so again yeah i'm not the type of youtuber but after i kind of communicated with him a little bit it's just it just shows me that this guy um who's like doxing me saying that i have like a big ego he i don't think he really even watched my video he's only doxing me because i guess i have some sub count and maybe i click some websites and gave him the chance but still it, it's just like quite dumb but yeah um that's it for this game ggs Alright, so we're into our second game, and uh, honestly speaking, uh, there really isn't a point of me making this video, uh, because of course, I, I know for sure that you, I mean, obviously deep inside my heart, I, I know that even if I make it, you guys can't really do anything since nobody really know me IRL and stuff like that. You guys are just here because you guys happen to be a subscribe or somehow YouTube recommendations send you this video out of nowhere. Uh, but still, um, I'm kind of just making this just to make myself feel at least somewhat a little bit more comfortable like just speaking out some of the stressful thoughts that i've been having and this guy oh god i feel bad <laughs> guys play with your game sound on this shouldn't happen right now um i don't know i i, I don't really feel like really talking i i don't really trust like other people uh, earlier as I mentioned I only have like two close friends where I feel comfortable actually talking with them about what I'm thinking and besides them not even my parents I, I don't talk with like really anyone um, I mean right now the corona virus situation has gotten somewhat better in where I live and my school is offering to have us go back to school and stuff like that uh, but for some reason um, I don't know I just can't like so they're having this program basically you can um, you can have the option to either continue staying at home and having online class or you can like go to school like half half or something like that uh, but for some reason I, I don't know why I, I don't have the courage to go to school anymore for some reason i just i don't know i feel like i'm like starting to be like scared of like the the outside world <laughs> this sounds really bad i know guys this sounds really bad but but uh right now uh any any time uh when someone gave me the thought of like going outside it just i don't know it just kind of scares me i don't know why this is really bad um I, sometimes i I, just, I think i might need to go see a therapy or something uh, but then again like uh, my parents you know that's like the typical asian parents you guys probably watch those uh asian meme videos like the the parent literally saying oh you're just weak why yeah, so man. weak so weak yeah they said the same thing <laughs> you're too weak <laughs> they actually said it was so funny I was half cringing and then half like pretty triggered. It's like why, why would you say that it hurts? <laughs> um, I know it's kind of a serious video topic, but right now uh, I'm kind of half laughing and half crying. I, I kind of find my situation pretty cringe, but then also pretty helpless. Um, it's Oh, still, still, it's pretty nice to just, um, like, actually speak out. Uh, but again, um, 
it's only just making me feel better, I guess, a little bit, like, mentally. Um, I'm not physically getting anything solved, I know this myself. Uh, but I guess it's good to maybe at least let you guys know what I'm going through right now. Um, the next thing that I want to talk about is, uh, oh, this one is quite funny. I find this to be really funny. Um, so I got someone, someone hacking to my bank account. <laughs> And yes, guys, I don't know. Okay, I don't know how. I don't know how. It, it's it, it's so dumb, but it, it happened. I literally have like at least twenty five. Like, as I said, I I don't. I'm not uh, that type of person that feels secure all the time. Like all my passwords are at least twenty five digits mixed with like numbers and letters. But somehow someone still got access to my bank account. And um, initially, I didn't really suspect anything. But then, until, until, so basically I check my uh, bank records uh, almost every day and initially all the purchases were just almost normal and I don't see anything like suspicious. So basically, um, like everything was fine and he was like spending money. I didn't notice until he's already spent like $700. But guess what this guy bought? So he used my bank account and then he bought like something like a uh, Netflix monthly subscription. <laughs> And what's more is that um, there is um, this transaction of uh, him using my card paying like a uh, Google YouTube. So basically he used my money as sim funding and he probably donated to some streamers and or, or something. He probably bought some like um, YouTube channel monthly subscription, which I find like so funny. <laughs> But yeah, uh, when I found out, he already like spent seven hundred dollars, which is kind of scary, I guess. Um, but uh, no worries, guys. I already talked to the bank, and they've investigated into it, and they've confirmed that it did. I I've been scammed. So um, right now, they've refunded me all the money, the all seven hundred dollars that I've been scammed. So no worries. But still, I still find this story to be very cringe and just hilarious. Um, it's still like quite shocking to me though, because honestly, uh, I think that for someone like this guy, whoever, you know, hacked like into my like bank account and stuff like that, uh, if he has the skill to actually like do something like this, like why don't he use the skill to do something better? Like maybe like start a YouTube channel, tell people how to prevent um, their account being hacked or just telling us more about this whole like online security system. I don't know why like they're doing something like this instead it's not getting him anywhere and it's also illegal he's just wasting his talent uh, yeah it's it's quite dumb and besides that another thing happening yes guys i don't know why these things are happening to me i i'm deeply triggered although i sound like i'm just joking and stuff but then i'm actually quite triggered <laughs> when i just think about this um all right guys uh <laughs> Alright guys, in order to make back the $700, uh, I'm gonna put uh, at least 25 mineral ads in this video, alright? Guys, make sure to watch every single second of the advertisement. The next um, shocking story is just my YouTube account getting hacked. Um, so uh, recently I started getting notifications, like Google sent me verification code at like 1 a.m. of my time, like of course I was sleeping, there's no way. And then it's in a special language, I don't know what language this is. Um, I'm just gonna show the picture online. And then it, it, it's, it's pretty scary because um, for whoever this guy is to get to the step of uh, having Google send you like a verification code you have to be inputting the right password like you have to have like the the correct password and then google needs to verify oh he's gonna send the code to your phone and then it's gonna verify okay it's you but this guy actually got my password which is ridiculous um oh god this guy um well guess what i have a kb stick uh, you know what? I I'm gonna just gap up a little bit. This is not very. Uh, okay. Uh, there can I run away? I'm gonna. I'm just gonna run away right now. This is very bad. Oh, uh, 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 uh. You don't wanna do this. I haven't finished my commentary. Please don't. Please don't. Please don't. Please don't. Okay. All right. Whatever. Okay. I'm gonna finish this game. Um. <laughs> Alright guys, fantastic. Now I have to do one more game because I couldn't finish where I left off. This is fantastic. Uh, but first, uh, I'm gonna take advantage of this map and then do the first rush.
Uh, Alright, 32 rush, and this guy just came out, and then he realized that his pet is actually gone. Oh god, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Okay, okay, I got it. Alright, so, basically, um... From where I left off, um, my YouTube account, that was actually so close, uh, thank god that I said like a two-step, um, authentication access or something like that, 2FA, I don't know what that is called, uh, but still, if I didn't said that, he basically already has my password, and he would have gotten into my YouTube account, and, and then god knows what he's gonna do after he gets, I, I don't know, he, after he logged onto my... He could have deleted my video and stuff like that. Um, I mean, uh, for you guys as a viewer, uh, you guys probably never really experienced something like this. But um, the feeling of constantly having people attempting to hack into your account and then people constantly trying to get your personal info, um, it is quite stressful. Uh, although, like, you know, I've taken enough, like, precaution to make sure that doesn't happen. Like... What are they trying to really, like, accomplish? Like, yeah, cool, even- Wait, this guy- He's hopping?! Um, okay, thank- Well, fantastic, Hypixel is also just having a stroke right now. This is nice. I mean, a lot of you, after watching this video, probably gonna tell me how to protect my account better, but right now, I, I have, like, a, what, 28-digit password. I changed uh, my YouTube account password, and, um... Basically, I added like a triple verification. So right now there's like a Google verification app or something. Um, basically, now if I need to log in, I need to first get the right password. Uh, second, I need to input the code that Google is gonna send to my IRL phone. And third, I need to get the code from the Google verification app, like the randomly generated code that changes uh, every 20 seconds. And you can only uh, get the actual code if you have the app and you own this phone IRL. Um, yeah, um, right now, if I wanna add a... Wait, this guy, he just... Oh, now he does. Wait, I trigger your trap. I trigger your trap. Is Emerald more important than your bed? Oh, yeah, he, it is. Hi. Yeah, this way. Thank you. Just constantly tapping him off. Jeez. Oh, wait. I think I got him. Mm, but still, right now, if I wanna, like, add a new device to my, like, uh, like, Gmail account, it's gonna take, like, what, at least, like, three sec- uh, three minutes? It's- <laughs> Uh, sometimes I, I just question myself, why, why do I have to go through all this? Like, a lot of time it's like, what did I do wrong that made me deserve this? I mean, um, it's, it just always feel like, uh, uh, oh, he's building a house. Should I just keep letting him? Oh, no, there's another team. You know, you know what? Let me, let me go for red instead of going for green. Um, shop is now open. Wait. This guy is making a shop. Wow, that's fantastic. I, I, I'll see what I can buy in just a second. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, this guy's bridge to mid, finally. This guy's name is uh, Mob Noob. That is actually really interesting. Uh, little does he know, I, I am the king of noobs. <laughs> I'm the king of noobs himself. Oh my god, alright, uh, I think that's gonna be it for Mob Noob. Good game, good game, good fight. I, I might have uh, clicked on some like websites or maybe some links or maybe I bought subscriptions of like some some sorts, I don't know, and they got my like actual info. Um, I don't know why like I got so many things hacked, but then right now uh, I requested new bank account. Uh, like basically I'm gonna get a new card in like about three days. And I got refunded. Uh, oh yeah, I have nothing to pay him. This is bad. Wait, did he? Oh. Comment what you think. I at this point, I, I I wanted to maybe just read more comments and then see what you guys think about because uh, I don't really have anyone to really interact with. Uh, but let me see. Right now, I want to figure out what this screen guy's trying to do. <laughs> more money. Oh, I, I paid. Oh, he's actually. He, wait. Oh, 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 oh. No, GG. <laughs>